Ladies and gentlemen, it is your host here that is correct. It is Team Rai Rai here. Anyway, how are you doing on this Tuesday's edition? I am doing pretty well. Everyone out there who's watching this video, I have social media accounts. But don't worry, I'll discuss that later on in this video. Now, I want you and ladies sit back, relax, put your feet up, grab some eat, or grab something to drink, or maybe, just maybe, you want to chill like a villain and hear my thoughts, my opinions on this subject. And of course, the link will be down below, or the article will be down below. Now, in this video, it will be strictly a link because there's an article plus there's a video down below. Or either or, check it out. Alrighty then, probably you know about this news already. That WWE decided to get Rhea Ripley a new title. And when I seen this last night, it's the same old like Seth Rollins. But for the women's uh, version, you know. I don't understand why in the hell WWE has to copy off the men's. I don't understand this. They should have one for men's, a different look, and then the other one, a different look for the women's. Whatever, you know what I'm saying? It's just very, very lazy creating ideas for these belts. You know? It seemed like Raw for the men's and for the women are 10 times better than the ones on SmackDown. For the men's and and for the women's. I don't know why. It just is. You know? One good thing is they don't say Raw Women's Champion. They just say Women's Champion. That's good. They got rid of that stupid name. That's so dumb. So, you know, it's so obvious they're going to give her a new belt. But I just don't like the design. But we just got to deal with it, you know? How long is this going to last? Do you like the new belt? Or not. It reminds me of Seth Rollins belt. That makes no sense. You know. My opinion is. I don't know if you guys agree. They should keep it. The women separated. For the men's. You know. Yes I know. Women could do the, almost the same things. As the men's in their matches. But the titles. It should be a different ball game. You know what I'm saying. So, whatever. Who came up with this idea? Do you think Vince has anything to do with it? Or do you think it's Triple H's idea the whole entire time? You know? How much does this cost on their website? Probably outrageous prices. You don't get the real thing and you get the replica belt. So, I think and eventually they will change it again, you know? None of these belts last forever in this company, you know? So what do they do with the old belts for the women's belt? Do you think they put it back in a warehouse? Or do you think they toss it? I think they put it in a warehouse to keep it in storage. They might pull it out for like W access for a WrestleMania weekend. But that's just my only theory. So what's your thoughts? Not surprise, surprise. Do you think the Raw for the men's is 10 times better than Roman's belt? And same thing for, uh, this, for the Raw for the women's are 10 times better than um, Asuka's belt. What's your thoughts? Who has a better design? Who's more lazier? I think it has to be SmackDown. Both ones are horrible. You know? And like I said before, they should have just kept it separate. You know, I have a different design for the men's on Raw and for the SmackDown, different for the women's, you know? You know, like, I know it's, I'm trying to hurry up with this video. Men's on Raw and the women's on Raw should be two different things. Don't, they should copy off the design. And same thing for the SmackDown. Why are they copying off for, of, um, for the men's in the women's belt, I don't understand that. I know the wrestler had no decision on it. You can see when Roman Reigns got that new belt, he said, really? You can do better on the longest 
champion this month, right? And you give me this crap. I know he's not too happy, but you just got to deal with it, you know? So, you know, W will change it eventually. Not now, but eventually. Just wait. It will happen. What's next? The tag team belts? That will be next and probably be all the same. Anyway, that's all I'm going to say. Follow me on Instagram, Twitch, Twitter, TikTok. All my social media accounts will be down below. If you want to be part of the Rise Show, that's fine and dandy. If not, don't worry about it. But please, reach out to me. It's not that hard. All the information will be down below. Have a good one. I'll see you guys tonight. Peace out.